Hi everyone, me again. Um, I've come along to show you a few projects I've made and it's been a while but uh, as you know I've had my gallbladder out so that took a while for me to uh, get over. Um, what else? Then obviously this craft shed needed doing and bringing all the stuff down, whatever you do, don't ever let your husband help you sort your craft stuff out because then he just obviously sees everything you've got big mistake um he was moaning you know what i mean but he says you know he says you're never going to use all this up <laughs> little does he know anyway i've made a few things this is one of them this uh i don't even know what you call it i think you've seen it on my wall but i took it down and uh, I hope this is not a glare from the sun. I'll go back a bit. Not sure how much you can see. Because I can't see a chuffing thing on this iPad. Um, yes, these are just circles. I used some pretty paper. Just the circles. I mean, you've, I'm sure you've seen it before. I've got this idea of Pinterest. And uh, people have made cards. And I think something, something to do with quilting, they call it, don't they? Paper quilting or paper piecing. No, not paper piecing. That's something different, isn't it? Paper quilting. And yes, you just punch out a circle, put your square in the middle, you know, then, um, what do you call it? Draw your lines with a... Oh, I've not done this for a long time, so I've lost my words. Use a stylus. I think that's what you call it. And then just draw your lines and fold them over. And then just put it on here and hope you... I mean, you can see a bit of a pencil line here. I've tried to, but I've still got it a bit crooked. But I love it. And I love the, you know, I love the pattern. And then I punched out little... I don't know whether you can see that. Little circles. And just uh, embossed them, you know, on a, with this on a mat. And uh, put some dimensionals underneath it. And put it on there. And that's that. Uh, the other thing I made is, uh, I don't know whether I've shown this to you in the year, but I don't think I did, is my bird, uh, bird house. Not cage, is it? It's a bird house. And uh, I've stamped all these images and uh, with Versamark, embossed them, and then I, I painted them all with uh, acrylic paint. So uh, it was a bit of a, you know, obviously I painted all the whole thing first make these little stripes and I got the idea of and I put the link below of Sarah my serenity crafts yeah that's right I think <laughs> my serenity crafts um love her love that woman love everything she does I love her videos I always look forward to her videos coming on and uh, she gave me this idea and I bought this, this birdhouse. I was going to decoupage it, you know. But uh, I thought, when I saw Sarah do that, and I thought, yeah, I'll do that. So, uh, yes. That's my little birdhouse. I've got to varnish it, yeah. So, uh, that's that. Then I made these, look. Aren't they cute? I put some little thingies on now. Uh, some... I think I've put it on Instagram. A few people have seen them, but I didn't have the little, you know, flower centres on there. But you just open it up and it's it's just a milk carton, you know, and you put your little sweeties in. And somebody on um, Crafting with Jody said I should put some acetate behind it, you know, and then... What did you say to put in it? I can't remember. Anyway, you can put anything in it then, can't you? And that's a great idea. So, uh, yeah made a couple of them you know I've put those oh look they've gone all flat where have they stayed up can you see that the flower centers they've gone all flat let me just try that while I'm here doing nothing now I can't remember what color I used I think it was this pink one wasn't it I'm gonna have to do that again watch it squirt out no nope. I don't know whether it was this one I used, but it doesn't matter. That one's covered up now. There. 
That's better, isn't it? Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I don't know whether I made it worse. Anyway. That's that. But I love them. Anyway. Little bird has it. What else I got? One of these. I saw... Oh, God, I can't remember her name now. That lady on YouTube now, and she's got a Facebook page. Makes all those beautiful paper flowers. Oh, God. Sorry, I can't remember. Put a link below her, a link below her in the description box for her as well. And mine didn't turn out as good as hers. You want to see hers? Oh. Absolutely fantastic. Anyway, I made this little box. You know the drawer box. You just open this and then, you know, this, 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 just like the drawers come out. I love these boxes. I love, mind you, I love boxes. I love making boxes. Never know what to do with them afterwards, but I just love making them. So that's that. And what else? Oh, that little, yes, the CD. Um... Was it Angie who asked me to make a little, um, little? I saw this. I saw this on Facebook actually. Somebody put a video up, and they did it very quickly. So uh, yeah, it's just a box. It's just a box. You know, you just open it up, and you can see that it's just a couple of CDs which I put there and cut out. You know, on there. And then I drew the other one on there. Obviously got rid of the pencil lines. And then what you do is... Uh, I'll have to show you. I made a template. Where's that template now? Sorry, I'm looking. Is it that one? No, I don't know. I don't know where I've put it now. But I'll show you. I'll do another video on how to do that. And then you just emboss these, you know. Close it up and it's... And uh, and you have to obviously either you put a closure here or you put your ribbon round it like I have, and then uh, you got a little box, only a little tiny one. But uh, yeah, and that is it. That is all I've got to show you, and uh, that's all I've been doing. Um. Yeah. Oh, I've done me back in as well. I couldn't walk last week. Couldn't move, couldn't walk, couldn't go in here, couldn't sit, couldn't couldn't do anything. And that's it. So uh I'll see you again. Bye. <laughs>